Am I? Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. So, Gore, this was originally going to be our safe house here right outside of Fall Creek, this little cozy cabin. It'd be something that the, the three of us had to stay here. But it's just a good thing that uh, Kinnereth gave us the Elysium Estates. So nice. But, um, yeah, if you're ever on the road, you know, give you a key here so you can get into this, uh, this cottage. It's, uh, Shirelia's, uh, contacts in Hammerfell were able to set this up for us. All right. Shirelia, you said you had a lead on some vampires? Okay. Well, let's go on out here. What's this? Fight cave. Yeah, that, that's something that uh. Fighting styles often come safe down house. to build. You got arms like a clan fear, then you got no range with a weapon, but you're quick with a shield. All right, come on, let's go. That's something that our little safe house is right across the street road from a, a fight club cave. What, is that a dog? No, wasn't that uh, the blacksmith looking for a dog in Fall Creek? You are exactly what, what I was looking for. The, the, the dog is talking. D did you just talk? Yeah, Skyrim is now host to giant flying lizards and two-legged cat men. And you're surprised by me? Yes, yeah, I am. Talked, and I'm continuing to do so. You see, my name is Bobbis. And I have a problem I think you can help sort out. Me? What could a dog need help with? My master and I had a bit of a falling out. We got into an argument, and it got rather heated. He's kicked me out until I find someone who can settle our disagreement. That's where you come in. All right, well, it, it sounds easy enough. Uh, let's go find him. Thank you. Now, since he banished me, Vile's been rather weak. He can't Vile. manifest very far from one of his shrines. I know there's a cult that worships him at Hamar's Shane. We should be able to talk to him there. If this works out, I'll make sure you're rewarded. Hey, just don't trust any offer he makes you, okay? Yeah, whatever. Why did Vile kick you out? Well, I guess you could say I got on his knives. I tend to be the voice of reason, and he finds that uh, irksome. He couldn't just kill me, you see. We're technically part of each other. But he was able to banish me from his domain. Of course, because of our separation, Vile is now much weaker. I guess he figured it was a small price to pay for not having to listen to me anymore. I'd say that's a large price. All right, bye. We'll, we'll meet you at Amar Shane. I don't know about y'all, but I'm, I'm getting out of here. It's a talking dog. All right, but before we go any further, I need to pray. Madahunding, strengthen me and give me wisdom.
Destruction Mastery. Destruction spells cost 50% less magicka and destruction spells are 0.5% more powerful per level of destruction. Defiance, you are trained to deflect incoming attacks while wearing all heavy armor. Whenever an enemy attacks you, you gain 15 points of armor rating for 10 seconds. And this effect stacks. Defiance also increases melee weapon damage by 3% for 10 seconds. This effect stacks. Oh, you no longer need to wear a helmet to benefit from perks that require wearing all heavy armor. If you are not wearing a helmet, heavy armor pieces have 20% increased armor rating. And battle weary, tired enemies have a harder time defeating your armor. You take up to 20% less attack damage from enemies with half or less stamina. If wearing all heavy armor, the lower their stamina, the less damage you take. Smithing Mastery. I can create novice steel bone mailed items at a forger anvil and improve them twice as much. All items can be improved 10% more. Thank you, Excellent. Hoonding. All right, let's keep going. Try something. You're an executioner's hood. Steel pole axe. Ooh, like a vegetable or something buried under an avalanche of meat. So I uh, imagine this place is, this thing has been robbed, this caravan. All right, there's, 
there's just too many bodies here for me to ignore. Can I eat another ammo? Can I eat another werewolf? Yes. seem to get to these bodies over here. That should be all of them. Okay, lucky for me, nobody came along around while I was feeding. Uh-oh. Guess my luck just ran out. What is it? I hear arrows. Where are they coming from? this more bandits and you thought I was just a pretty face I'll kill you I don't think so all right get them Strengthening myself for this vampire battle. Don't get too alarmed. What a 
are we going to kill today? Bandits? Forsworn? Imperials? Stormcloaks? So many choices. So hard to choose. All right, now we should be done unless somebody else is going to be foolish enough to attack us again. That's a lot of arrows. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Oh, good. Here we are. Hamar's shame. There's no sign of Barbus. He's had plenty of time to get here before we did. Alright, let's go on inside. Bandit camp. No, vampire! Vampire, get it! Get it! Get it! There we go. There we go. I'll find you. There's more. Come on. I don't think so. Get him. Get that vampire. Kill her. Let her get away. Let you go. Now you're going to die. As for my family and my village that y'all destroyed, I'm going to kill every last one of you. All right, what they got here? Where, and I haven't even gotten... Where's the dust? I want the dust. Wasn't there another one up here? Oh, I forgot my... My lantern. Yeah. What is this? According to the paperwork, it's Nolus Saladia. I don't think this is a vampire. It must have been some kind of a thrall. 
Come on. Um, Cerulea. How do we happen to run into a dog and end up in a cave fighting vampires? When I specifically told you that I was ready to start to fight them. You are responsible for this, I know. But thank you. I'm not complaining. Yet. Did I ever tell you I spent half a year in a dungeon? It I took three coffin. companions to haul me in. I don't know what for. But I reckon they yeah. had good cause. Yes, Gore, you did tell me. Come on. Definitely trouble ahead. I, I sort of blacked out. They're in here. Get her. Look out. This thing's tough. down there. Hold on, hold on. Oh, I want the dust. What, what did this man have? Nothing. enough. Hold on. There we go. You can't hide from me. I'm not hiding. You see me standing here. Oh, there's a thrall coming. Y'all get ready. She's just gonna stand there and let me shoot her with arrows. the thrall. So he just died, or oh, I thought I saw another person down here.
right, this is good enough. Look, look at this, a coffin. Another one. Get him. I don't plan on being killed by the likes of you. There you go. Talking dog. Nothing to say, huh? Oh. Hello. Um. Clavicus Val. By all means, let's hear it. It's the least I could do since you already helped me grant one final wish for my last worshippers. They were suffering so from vampirism and begged me for a cure. 
Then you came and ended their misery. I couldn't have planned it better myself. I couldn't have either. So, I needed what's that. your heart's desire? What kind of deal can we strike? Um, well, actually... The power to crush all before me. Really? Power? Haven't you already killed enough of your foes using the more mundane means at your disposal? Swords, magic, etc. How uninspired. As much as I hate to say it, you're almost as powerful as I am right now. What, really? But that's just because half of my power resides in that mutt Barbis. Hey, come to think of it, I know of a win-win situation for both of us. All right, what is it? There's an axe. An incredibly powerful axe. An axe powerful enough for me to have quite a bit of fun indeed. If you bring it to me, I'll grant you my boon. No strings attached, no messy surprises. At least not for you. As I recall, it's resting in Rhyme Rock Burrow. Barbers can lead you right to it. Little Mutt might even earn his place back at my side. <laughs> oh, follow the Daedric Prince Clavicus Vile. Clavicus Vile is the prince whose sphere of power through ritual invocations and packs improve conjuration spells and can make packs. Pray to accept a pact and complete it as written within the allotted time. Never break or ignore the packs. No. I reject. Okay, well, I guess we, uh, need to go with Barbara somewhere. What, what is this? A molten egg. Increases speech by 60 points. These molten eggs are said to have been forged inside an oblivion gate during the Third Era Crisis in an attempt to create a weapon to thwart Maroon's Dagon's plot to conquer all of Nern and Mundus. Wow. stones too. Here we are at Dragon's Bridge. We need to find this location that Clavicus Vile wants us to go to. It looks like it's somewhere over the top of this mountain. Oh, let me make sure I'm discovering things. Mm. Oh, we go. Oh, Penitus Oculatus, huh? Hmm. Where are the garb of a true Nord? 
I salute you. That really wasn't my intent. What's going on here? Y'all got a horse out here fighting. And look, the woman is dead. You supposed to be her bodyguard? Need something? Look, yeah, I need you to do a better job in the future. I hope this is a life lesson for you. Come on, let's go. I hope this person over here doesn't want to fight because I'm not in the mood. What's a milk drinker like you doing out oh. here? Go home to your mother. Are you serious? You can't talk to me like that. Why? What are you gonna do? Cry? Mm. Back off now. No need to get rough. your hours. Oh. All right. I'm sorry he needed to be taught a lesson. Unfortunately, it was permanent and everlasting. Look out, Barbus. Oh, 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 no. Get it. is taking care of that ice ray. Yep. Good work. my skin crawl just to look at it. Okay. I feel powered up now. Let's go. So we're looking for an axe, if I recall correctly. Uh-oh, I hear footsteps. Uh-oh, an astronaut.
Uh-oh. There's a mage up there. Let's get him. Rush him. Staff of Flame Darts. And here's the axe. Let's see what's back here before we go. An heirloom chest. this a, a blue ring cap illusion spells and enchantments cost 30% less a blue ring tunic fortifies sneak and alteration by 20% increases damage resistance by 30% huh. and a what is that a she a shikai dagger hmm Okay, looks like that could hurt. All right. And what else have we got here? A nice big coin purse. A songbook page. The Amulet of Clavicus Vile. Hmm. All right, I guess we've got enough stuff here. Let's get out of here. Come on. Let's get back to Clavicus Vile. All right, Clavicus, we're back. Ah, you've got the axe and my dog. Splendid. All right, if you would fulfill your end of the bargain, I can be out of here. Excellent work. A hero and his faithful companion retrieving the ancient artifact for the prince. It's almost storybook. 
Ah, oh, but it almost seems a shame to give a weapon like that away, doesn't it? I suppose I could be persuaded to let you keep it. But only if you use the axe to kill barbers. Simple as that. No deal. Come get out of here. You take the axe and you take back the dog. Huh. You're no fun at all. No, I'm not. I'm not so in the mood. I'll make my own fun elsewhere. And with the pup back, I'll be restored to my full power. There's a whole world just waiting for me! I knew I could trust you. Yeah, yeah, dog gets master, master gets cosmic axe. Everyone's happy. Just get over here, mutt. Don't worry, I'll make sure he sees the light. I trusted you. Now you trust me. What? Oh, that I was so in the lock of the door. You forget how nice the green power feels until you've been stuck right. in a cave for a few wasn't years. Right. Wasn't now, fair. as for your wish, power, was it? You can be part of a tremendous power. All you have to do is let your soul be absorbed by this axe. I've never said it would be your power. Oh, fine. Have my bone and be done with it. Got more interesting deals to make anyway. Alright, let's get out of here. I don't like dealing with the Daedra at all. Sherry, thank you for exposing me to the vampires. It's really what I needed. I think I'm ready to take on some more. Come on, let's go.